Okay, everybody, we have reached my favorite part of the restoration project. In this video, we are gonna reveal the brand new custom upholstery for this boat. It's got new pad, new wood, new design. In addition, we're also gonna be heading up and meeting the man behind the sewing machine. Uh, Rich, who does this work, I finally get to meet him. Stick around. Okay, so this guy did the custom upholstery for the 92 yellow and gray ski nautique. If you haven't seen that video of that restoration, you should check it out on my channel. I had to go back to him again for this custom project here. A little bit trickier, a lot more pieces, and it was in much worse shape, so there was a lot more for him to do. Uh, but I finally got to head up there and see it. Here it is, creative colors. see where this boat's at front door's locked i guess we're just walking in here let's see where she's at oh <gasps> hello are you rich i am you're the man, the man. The man. this is the guy right here this is rich hello. how are you doing buddy good it's nice to finally meet you yeah wow this is pretty cool all right, we're going to cut right to it. Here's the before and after pictures of this boat and the new upholstery. The old upholstery actually looks better than it really would up close. Most of it is actually duct tape at this point. We went with the red, white, and blue theme to mask the outside of the boat. It looked awesome, especially the side panels. And Rich even put red, white, and blue stripes down the captain's chair. It looks amazing. So this is Rich. This is the guy that does... All this beautiful upholstery work. He did my last boat, he did this boat. He didn't even know it yet. He's gonna do the boat I bought uh, two days ago in right. Alabama, maybe. So this is where the magic happens. So where do you do all this, uh, where do you do the boat upholstery at? What are the machines you use? Here, come check it out. We've got, so excuse the best by the way. It's uh, a warehouse. We've got a, we've got a pontoon kind of in process here. Uh, it's the actual boat itself is not here but the furniture is in process and this is kind of where some of the upholstery magic happens excuse the mess uh the guys were busy working today on all you name it all kinds of different boat things today wow what is this so this is a little bit unorthodox for an upholstery shop um usually most of the manufacturing places around here have these things this is an automated gerber cutting table what um, yeah automated so, gerber cutting table so it's cnc operated this unit this head unit over here has a blade attached to it and once we pre-program our patterns and we just roll the material all the way across the whole table uh hit the button and this thing will zoom around flying around it's, automatic computer control it's just like cutting out cutting, cutting the material so you do it on a computer it's all done on this computer right over here this computer over here. Well, that's all right. Interesting. This is this is for me who's who still like thinks you know maybe the next boat I'll do my own upholstery, <laughs> and now I'm looking at this being like maybe I won't. No, what's funny is this we do not utilize for the custom boats. Okay. Um, so those have to be like for your boat, for example. Um, everything, even the old cover, some of them had been reupholstered, like your captain chair, for example, did not have the racing stripes in it. It was actually all plain blue seat at the bottom. Yeah, so I, it, I remember that. And yeah. so in like those cases, we actually, and we had to rebuild all the wood, rebuild all the foam. So we went one piece at a time. Once the structure was rebuilt, once the foam was all put together, uh, taking it and laying the patterns out, just a piece at a time and hand cutting and hand patterning and getting those original you know patterns back into the cover to make the new covers yeah um so it's kind of a process not can't be done with a computer so no it's a little bit different no and it can't be done by an amateur like me <laughs> that's why i tell the people that watch my channel it's like my my philosophy really is i'm gonna you know i'm gonna do everything else by myself as cheaply as possible you know from like a, a steering wheel that's a much cheaper version than a 400 dollars replacement and antique steering wheel i'll skimp and save everywhere i can so i can put all the money into the upholstery 
okay. and have have you guys do it because that's what you sit on. That's what you're going to be enjoying the whole time. Well, that's what um, you see. Too. That's what you see. That's yeah, that's the see. comfort of you the really boat. Do. That's that's what makes the ski boat great again. That's my channel, by the way. Makes <laughs> ski boats great again. That's what we do. Oh, gotcha. Hey, you got to know this though. You see this baby right here? This Air Nautique. Yeah. This is what I just bought. Really? Rich, I appreciate it. Absolutely. Great work. The people that will watch this will love that you make ski boats great again. All right, so we're not done yet. I still have some pieces to clean up and some assembly to do. I've got some hardware to take care of. Ultimate Black is a product that I always use on anything that's black, especially if it's plastic. Cleans it up great. Does a wonderful job. You'll see the results right here. See how she does.
Oh, it's nice to see you right there. All right, thanks for sticking around to the end of this video. If you're still watching, you must be pretty serious about making ski boats great again. Maybe thinking about having your old boat reupholstered, which means you're going to be asking in the comments the number one question I get, which is how much did that cost? Um, I'll go ahead and tell you that was pretty pricey. Um, 4300 I think it's what I paid for that custom upholstery job. You can definitely get that done for much cheaper, but you cannot get it done better than what that guy did. So my motto has always been to skimp and save and, and find ways to get these boats restored as cheaply as possible so you can put all your money into having professionally done custom upholstery. That's where it's all at. If you're not subscribed to this channel, please do. We have the final reveal coming up pretty soon. Uh, the next video is going to be on all the engine work that I have done. It ended up being a little bit more than I predicted, so stick around.